if you've got like factory bushings or urethane bushings, you don't want to do the final tour until the car is setting at right height. Uh, especially if you've got like rubber, like rubber bushings, factory bushings, you want to be sure the car is setting at right height. If the car is jacked up and the suspension is drooped and you torque, torque the bushings down and it's like the rubber bushings or even some urethane, then what's going to happen is it's actually going to put some spring rate into it. It's worse on, on rubber bushings. It's actually going to put some spring rate. So as the car goes down, all of a sudden the bushings are preloaded, which means you're going to wear out a lot faster. Urethane isn't so bad uh, because that actually moves, but I'd still just do them with, when you're at right height. Now, like our on our uh, rear grip kit, with all the rod ends, it doesn't make any difference. Uh, it makes zero difference because the rod ends have such good movement that it doesn't matter what position they're in. I mean, they're locked down, the ball's locked down, but the, the control arm keeps going up and down. So if, if you've got rubber bushings, absolutely uh, torque the, your control arms when it's at right height. Uh, I'd also kind of recommend that for urethane, although it's not really as critical. Uh, but for like our suspensions with ridings, it doesn't matter which position you're in, just bolt them down.